This is normally when I would say hello everybody in YouTube land and welcome to another blog post posted by usandroidtv.com. Um, but we're going to start out a little bit differently and I'm going to aim specifically towards my US Android TV uh, customers at usandroidtv.com and uh, even more generally than that I'm going to aim towards uh, my customers or not my customers but people that use Elysium as their third party add-on primarily. So if you've noticed the last few days and this is in my discovery this has been with TV shows that you know it's it's working but it's not working so that's going to be the title of this is going to be is Elysium is not working so and here's what I wanted to show you real quick and it might be like of a blip of an eye hopefully not but you know what I'll just I'll load something up that hopefully it's not in the cache already now, it, this is normal, you know, if, if your TMDB key is straight, everything's good. But as you can see, if you look closely where it says links, uh, you have 0, 1080, you have 1, 7, uh, 20, and then you've got 582, either 480 or 360, and it, it's continuing to grow. Remaining providers is 1, um, and that's all normal. So that's all working as it should. The problem is, is that when it goes to this next screen, it only displays 9 or 10 options, not 691. And there you go, it's 10. <laughs> now, if you're in the United States and you try to watch Google, you know, G Video, which is Google Video or Google Link, or if you're trying to pair with Open Load, um, you're not going to be able to watch this show. So, you know, the thing is, and I can show you right now, I'll just click it. I'll start at one, which is G video. And because of geo, uh, G video's geofencing, as I described in an earlier video, it's going to pass right by it. So as you can see, it's rolling by all of them. And open load's not going to do it because I don't pair with them. Vid no didn't work. So no stream available if you see that in the right hand corner. So again, this is aimed, you know, hopefully, let's, let's break this up into two things. Number one, if somebody is watching this video that happens to know a developer with Elysium, the third-party add-on with Cody, they could forward this message to them. They really need to do an update because I have multiple boxes and I have multiple customers that are all reporting the same problem that all have different ISPs and are located geographically in different parts of the United States. So it's not just isolated to my ISP or uh, my IP or my box, or any of that. Uh, it's, it's definitely the third party add-on. And even more so, this is the second part of this video, which is, you know, if you're having problems with this. So a lot of people get upset. You know, I've had, um, we've been watching ER. If you've watched all videos, you know that we're doing the ER series, uh, season one through 15. And we're on 10, and it's the same problem. If I try to pull up you know, an episode on season 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, I get three or four options. So on to the second part of the video. So my customers, my U.S. Android TV uh, customers, when you load your Kodi program, you're going to get all the goodies that you get from me, which is it will start uh, the script, uh, all the add-ons will be enabled, and then in the lower right hand corner of the screen, you'll get the easy maintenance, uh, you know, manager. And then you'll get the cleaner because with mine, it automatically cleans. My customers automatically clean every time. Um, here's what I want to show you guys. So, again, usandroidtv.com uh, customers. This, you know, anybody else at this point, uh, hopefully your box is good enough and something will be similar like this. But if not, you can always buy a budget box from us. It's $60. Uh, plus shipping at usandroidtv.com. That's not necessarily a push, but if you're kind of screwed and you don't have cable, you don't have Netflix, you don't have Hulu, you don't have Amazon TV or any of the paid subscriptions, and you're relying solely on streaming Android TV, then right now you're pretty upset. But here's the fix, and as soon as Elysium does their repair, um, I will more than gladly you know, post an updated video and let you know that everything's okay, or I'll comment it. Uh, comment in it in the uh, section here. So on the US Android TV box, your first thing is movies. Uh, if you go to the right, one, two, three, four selections to collections, no rhyme intended, um, 
And then you go down one. Now, it should automatically be to, and that's why I did the skin, but it didn't do it. Um, it should automatically be to watch more. So you go to collections, you go down one, it goes to watch more, and then you click, single click, OK. Well, it's going to pull up a whole bunch of video add-ons for you, which is exactly what it's supposed to do. Here's my quick and easy fix. And you guys know me. I'm long-winded. I'm already at 5 minutes and 30 seconds. So here's my real quick fix. Exodus is working fine. Um, and to show you, um, well, let me go back. We'll get to that. Exodus. So you, you scroll down to Exodus. Some people like Bob. Some people like uh, Specto Fork, which is on the build. Some people, you know, use Wolfpack and different things, Stream Army. All those are on here and available to you. So, I mean, if you are comfortable and already using different, uh, different third-party add-on, that's fine. But I'm trying to make it easy for the people that feel helpless. So, real simply, you know, we go to Exodus and we single-click OK. It's going to pull up the add-on information box. We scroll down three selections to open. And then we single-click OK, which will open the... Um, I just lost my train of thought. My Exodus add-on. I apologize for that. You're then going to see this screen here, I believe. No, you're not. Uh, I went back too far. My apologies. Let's do that again. Exodus. Open. Yes. There you go. You should get movies, TV shows, my movies, so on and so forth. So, again, we're having trouble with Elysium on the TV show side, not necessarily the movie side right now. Although when the whole API key thing was happening, it seemed like TV shows was the first to deteriorate and then movies to follow. But again, if you're a usandroidtv.com customer, we've already supplied an API key with every box. So I guarantee it's not that problem. I've already tested that. And by the way, while we're talking about what I've tested, I've spent hours on the Elysium add-on trying different things to see if I could rectify the situation. Since especially with our build, it's Elysium heavy. Um, and there was no fix. So for right now, I'm just kind of going, you know, to Exodus and I'm using that. So we go to TV shows. I'm going to make it real quick. And um, I, I, I'm starting from the bottom because if I go to search, which is the last option, uh, it'll pull up everything that I've searched. Well, here we go. There's Big Bang Theory. So I go ahead. Excuse me. I got the sniffles. Uh, if I hit the Big Bang Theory, uh, here it is, Big Bang Theory. And as you can see, everything's working on that. Now we got season 11. That's fine. Now remember before, and it looks a little bit different. This is the Netflix look. And not to you know misuse their term, but that's exactly what it is. Um, but there's the one I was trying to watch before. Now let me, let me go ahead and pull this up in real time, okay? Because I wanted to show you. You saw on the other one it had nine that pulled up on the, on the screen. And I want to show you that it is, in fact, the third-party add-on Elysium, which I, US Android TV, have no control over whatsoever. Um, so I want to just show you that on Exodus, which is another video add-on inside of our usandroidtv.com build, that you can watch anything that you want. And I know it's a little bit of an inconvenience, and I do apologize for that, especially if you have favorites that are saved, because if we put preloaded favorites for you we did it off of Elysium and you're probably getting pretty frustrated so I don't want you to get frustrated with me because I have nothing to do with Elysium you know just at the time they were the greatest add-on and hopefully soon again they will be so now here you go if I hit the up arrow to go to the very bottom of the list there's 483 that pull up okay so now we know we're cooking right so I'll scroll down to one that I know that works on Exodus which is the source put locker and I'll hit OK. I'll click that one time. Just like you would in Elysium. And put, uh, put Locker didn't work. X Movies is working. But as you can see right now, I'm able to pull it up. It pulls up the show. And the show is in 720, so it is in HD. And again, this is a show that aired on January 4th, 2018. And it's fine. And that's exactly what I did. Um, and as a matter of fact, the TV shows that we've been keeping up with... Uh, you can see that we have in our search, um, you know, that, I, that we're currently watching, which is Mom, Big Bang Theory, Orville, and there's a couple others that we're going to be adding to this until Elysium does their update and hopefully fixes the problem. 
So for right now, I'm going to conclude the video. I really hope that this helped you out. Again, not only if you're a usandroidtv.com uh, customer, but also if you are using Elysium, you are not alone. You are not experiencing this on your own. If you're trying to load a TV show and it's only pulling up 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, you know, uh, different sources and you can't watch any of them, you're not alone. So if you're not a usandroidtv.com customer and you've hung on with me this long through the video, which is now uh, approaching 10 minutes and 30 seconds, or it's a little over, then, then you know to go to where your video add-ons are, however you get there. Choose a different third-party add-on. Exodus is working just fine. I haven't tested Specto Fork. Um, they really kind of disappointed me, and I was kind of I kind of shunned away from them. But Exodus is working just fine, and it is playing. And knock on wood, and I'm going to actually knock on wood. Uh, any show that I watched on here, which is now a couple episodes of Mom, Big Bang Theory, and Orville, I've been able to watch them usually in HD and with no zero buffering. So uh, applause. For Exodus, uh, I don't know if they grew their servers or what they did, but they did something right. And again, I'm going to conclude the video. That's all I wanted to put out. It's going to be on my blog post on my website, usandroidtv.com. Uh, if you find this video helpful, you know, feel free to share it with anybody. And always, like I say in every video, don't forget to subscribe because I really don't put out a lot of videos. I put out one a week. Uh, especially, like I said, unless there's something going on, and this is my video for the week. Uh, don't forget to hit that notifications bell and turn on notifications so that you're updated anytime I, I put on a video. And uh, if you're not yet a subscriber, please subscribe. And of course, if you always have any questions, you can always visit uh, usandroidtv.com. All one word, all lowercase, usandroidtv.com. And I have different links on there, like FAQ, Vlog, uh, which is what this is going on, as well as user manuals and reviews. So until next time, YouTube land, I'm sorry again for the long video. Uh, I'm humbled for all of my subscribers and followers. Thank you so much. And if you, like I said, if you feel like sharing this with anybody, go ahead, because I want to help as many people as possible. So until next time, YouTube land, adios, and we'll catch you later.